Prime Minister Lee Hsien Loong said on Saturday that the government will ensure that schools have funds to pursue programs like the arts or music so that every school has a special strength. And it shows what we have been saying, that we make every school a good school. We make sure that every school has some special strength, whether it's in dancing or in art or in calligraphy or in music, so that when your kid goes there, he or she can learn something special, not just in the books, but something which they will enjoy, something which will appreciate for many years, all of their life. I think that we can do because we've got good teachers, we've got dedicated principals, and we have the resources to do this. We make sure that every school, you have a little bit of funds to carry out these activities, and if you have good ideas, we will find a way to support you with more resources and more funds. And if we can do that, then we can be sure that our kids will have a good education and a bright future. And growing up, not just with knowledge, but also with a sense that this is Singapore, this is how we live, and this is the society we belong to and which we should contribute back to. Prime Minister Lee was speaking at the Kerban Baru Division's Mid-Autumn Festival celebrations at Bishan Park, where he mingled with residents and watched performances like Crosstalk and Chinese Dance, which were put up by schools in Mr Lee's ward. Parents at the celebrations welcomed Mr Lee's remarks on encouraging children to excel outside of the academic arena. I think it's great because after all that piece of certificate only gets you that far. With all this participation and going out to meet real people doing real things, uh, it gives them a sense of achievement and to know what the real world is really like. So I think it's great. Uh, Modi CCA, she has fun. We enjoy watching them perform as well. And uh, besides academic achievement, I think Modi CCA uh, broadens their uh, scope. They, they see more things. They have um, a sense of being in a group. And yeah. I think she enjoys dancing. It's good to invest, uh, to have such a program. So I encourage them to, to excel in these areas and speak more uh, both language, uh, Chinese as well as English. It's more holistic. holistic. More holistic approach, yes. We uh, send him to those speech and drama uh, since young, both the Chinese as well as the English. So uh, because they like to act and like to perform in front of, um, of, of uh, many audience. So I thought, hey, well, since he's like this, this, uh, this area, we'll just let him try. Uh. Um, I think it's very funny and it gives us a lot of experience and I think um, basically it's really funny and you get to expose us to small Chinese language. And then when it's in a race, you get kind of happy when you get prizes. The event was attended by more than 1,000 residents of Ang Mo Kio and Bishan. I hope everyone has a happy birthday. I hope you have a happy birthday. I hope everyone has a happy birthday. And I hope everyone has a happy birthday.